we are going to review the caterpillar world and today our caterpillars have arrived look how tiny they are and what have you named them Gracie? are you going to show everybody? Okay, so that's it. So we have Rosie, Robbie, Caitlin, Bal, and Tinker. And soon they are going to be, they will be beautiful butterflies. It's only day two, but our caterpillars must have been up all night eating because they seem to have grown already. Look how chubby they look. Day four and they are looking bigger. We have one who doesn't seem to be growing as much as the other ones that hopefully he just needs a bit of a catch up soon. Let's see if we can see him. Now you can see the four big ones and right down here that little line is our teeny tiny one. He's so small that the camera won't even focus on him. It's day seven and the caterpillars have grown a lot. We still have one little tiny one, but he still seems to be alive, although he's not growing much. So we'll see what happens with him. But we have some very big ones growing. You can see from here. It's day 10 and the caterpillars have grown a lot in the 10 days since we've had on. We still have a teeny one, but he's still growing slowly. So we have our fingers crossed for him. The kids think it's hilarious that there's little balls of poo in there. A lovely fact for you. It's day 13 and they're still caterpillars. They're getting really, really big now though. And one of them has been hanging from the top of a tub all day and it has barely moved at all. So it surely can't be long. I will see the scared oh. caterpillars. I hope they still turn into a quissiest. I think they'll turn into a hipster. Are you excited for them to transform? Yeah. And are you going to be sad when we have to let them go? Yes. But you'll get to watch them turn into butterflies. That'll be exciting, won't it? It's day 17 and we have free chrysalide. They did appear yesterday. Finally, we still have two the caterpillars, so we're hoping that they will go through the change soon and then it'll be ready to put them in the net wait for the butterflies to emerge it's day 23 we have ha had a butterfly pop out we weren't quite ready for this as it's not in the net and we still have a caterpillar moving around so I don't quite know what to do next Zach we're, go we're going to save the caterpillar aren't we yeah. We had a chrysalis fall off, so we are going for a hunt for a nice leaf and some little flowers for when they do emerge and for our butterfly. Let's see what we can find. So we found a leaf and we've found some flowers and now we're going to take them home and put them in the butterfly net. My attempts to save our butterfly. I knocked down one of our chrysalis. Now... I have heard that once they fall down they might either die or become disabled so we are going to try our hardest to make a bit of a slope so that if a butterfly climbs out of a chrysalis then they can attach themselves to a nice slope rather than get stuck down there. Our plan is that hopefully if the butterfly does come out of the chrysalis, the butterfly will crawl out and attach itself to this big leaf. 
and our butterfly is safely at the top of the net, resting. We also, as we still have the caterpillar left inside the pot, have fashioned our own lid out of baking paper that's just the same as the original one. I need to give it a bit of a trim, but hopefully this means that our last caterpillar will still be able to <coughs> finish growing and attach itself to the top of the pot. day 25 and we have a third butterfly it was still a chrysalis this morning when we went out and of course it decided to come out in the hour that we left the house so we still haven't actually seen one coming out it looks like it's doing really well though chrysalis it's looked like this pretty much since yesterday there's movement in there but it's not looking good seems as there's nothing much happening The butterflies, however, I'm really happy. They've been flying around. I had one escape and sit on my hands yesterday. They're doing really well and they're enjoying their honey water. It's day 30 and caterpillars' moves aren't straight, so it can't fly and it comes down with crosses and doesn't seem to come out properly. So. I am a bit upset. You've had a bit of a cry tonight, haven't you? Yeah. You love your butterflies, don't you? Yeah. But you're going to release all the butterflies tomorrow, aren't you? Yeah. We still have Tinker though, don't we? Yay! I think Tinker the caterpillar is going to be with us forever because she doesn't want to turn into a chrysalis, does she? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, shall we keep her forever, shall we? Yeah. She's still doing well, isn't she? Yeah. But the three lovely big butterflies are still fine, aren't they? I can see two of them. I think there's another one hiding up here somewhere. I can see it. Yeah, it's hiding from me. <laughs> so tomorrow you'll see us say goodbye to the Beautiful butterflies. And what are we going to do with the poorly one, Gracie? Keep it. No. We said we were going to put it on a, on a flower. Yeah. Didn't we? We were going to find a nice pretty flower and let it sit in the flower. And stay out. Yeah, because so, it can't fly, but we want it to go somewhere pretty, don't we? And it doesn't want to stay in a net all by itself, does it? I know where there's a good place. Yeah? 
um, there's um, some grass um, over where we live and uh, we can let them go there. That's a good idea, isn't it? What about near the woods? And we've got some flowers near there. Yeah. We've got white and yellow ones and this yellow ones. Oh, I think I'll be able to carry it. We have to be very careful. <laughs> You're not scared of butterflies anymore, are you? No. No, you'll never be scared of butterflies again, will you? No. Because they're too lovely, aren't they? Yes. And what what have two of them done this week? Have they escaped in our front room? And yeah. they fly around, haven't they? Yeah. We got them back in. Cheeky butterflies. Cheeky. You cheeky. Don't you have to see that on your side out? And they said, you oh, cheeky. <laughs> Hi! It's time to set the butterflies free. But they're going to love their new home, aren't they? Uh, uh, Elsie, say bye bye, butterflies. Bye bye. They love you.